I'm going to do a video just talking about the situation going on in California right now, where they are basically um, about to experience on the verge of experiencing rolling blackouts. Um, call it a little energy crisis, but basically the electrical grid, the electrical system is uh, practically overloaded or unstable, whatever term you want to use for it. And it all basically stems from this ideology that they need to go extremely green. And if you think about the fact that they just banned the sale of new gas powered vehicles by 2035, you got to ask yourself, how much sense does that really make if you already at the point where you got to talk about the possibility of, or you were issuing emergency statuses because people about experience rolling blackouts? I'm not talking go green. I'm not talking don't go green. I'm talking about this don't make no sense because where is the transition? You want to go from using fossil fuels to go green. Where is the transition? It's like they're just trying to jump from one island to the other. So I think this picture I came across this this morning really summarizes the situation. You got a gas generator to charge your electric vehicle. Not only does that go against the whole ideology of going green, but now it's costing you more money. It's like, this just doesn't make sense. And this is something that I've talked about for a couple of years, just kind of in passing with people. But now it's definitely time to do a YouTube video on it. Um, and if you look at where the country is headed, they want to cut out fossil fuels, use less fossil fuels. But where do you get that electrical gener generation from? You got things like natural gas, coal, um, wind solar and hydro like those are some sources right nuclear energy is like a base load source but then if you look at nuclear pretty much the entire country is extremely against nuclear somebody like california is is that type of place so if they're just doing solar wind hydro you got solar wind hydro coal natural gas you want to take out coal natural gas right so now you're left with solar, wind, hydro. That's pretty much the situation California is in and wants to be in, or I'll say it's headed to. And this is what they're experiencing. So you just have to say, if the entire country is headed that way, if that's what our political leaders, leaders say we should be headed to, then this is the kind of situation that most of us are probably going to be in. And it's like, how is that okay? So I don't like to get into political stuff, but... This is the kind of stuff you have to think about when you go to vote. And I think this year is a really big year, especially with midterms. And I'm not knocking Democrats nor Republicans. I'm not knocking green energy. I'm all for green energy. I just think the cert, it just the transition ain't been making sense. It really don't make sense. And um, do with that as you please. And we'll just keep this video short, cut it here, and just keep these things in mind when you making decisions in life.